risk off. Investors seem to be pulling money out of U.S. equities and starting to play defense. Dom Chu is here with the numbers. Hey, Dom. All right. So, Melissa, one of the places that we want to look at is the technology funds out there. Investors have poured a lot of money, as you can see here, over the last couple of years. It's something that analysts over at Bank of America, Merrill Lynch, have pointed out, this idea that cumulative technology fund inflows have been in place for the better part of two years. But now all of a sudden, over the last couple of months, we've seen a maybe bit of a rollover. Are people now starting to take uh, at least money out of those tech funds to put them elsewhere? So that's something to watch. The other thing we want to take a look at is those fund flows over the course of this past week. U.S. equity redemptions have actually been pretty steep, down about $2.6 billion dollars over the course of the past week, all right? So that's something to watch there. Tech outflows down by about $500 million out of those funds over the course of the last week. Financial outflows down about $1.2 billion during that span as well. And the one place we are looking at some inflows is healthcare. We did see over the past week, according to Bank of America data, around $800 million worth of inflows into healthcare-related funds. One thing else to watch here, the rotation that's happening over the last three months, we have seen the outperformers be places like the Spider Utility Index, also real estate side of things and consumer staples. These traditional high dividend payers, more economically defensive sectors have been the ones that are outperforming. So could that trend stay intact? A lot of investors seem to be, at least for right now, getting a bit more defensive.